Social media, it can be a wonderful place to connect with people, learn and see new things, but also it can be a nightmare. A Belleville man is finding that out firsthand. A viral video shows what looks like him stealing from Walmart, but he says he was just doing his legal job. Our John Kipper spoke with the man in the video today in a story you'll only see on 4. His man is literally just stealing everything. A video of what looks like blatant theft at a Belleville Walmart. So open about it. Look at the screen. Ain't nothing bringing it up. Making its way across the world through social media. But the man in the video says it's not what it looks like. I'm not a thief. I'm being pictured and painted as a thief all over the internet. Bill Astle is the man in the video, sporting the same Battlehawk shirt that he wore on Mother's Day, the day he says it was taken. He works for Spark, Walmart's delivery service. While shopping, he scans the items from his phone. Everything is done off off the phone. So when we get to the register, we're not actually scanning a single item. He says when they get to the register, they just need to scan their phone into self-checkout and then bag the items. And yet, when he did that last month, he was unknowingly being filmed. Millions and millions of views. The video is on every major social media platform, from TikTok to Instagram to YouTube and over to Twitter X, which says it's been viewed nearly 16 million times on that platform alone. It's led to people calling him a thief online, even reaching out to the Battlehawk saying, please control your fans, and others saying, Ka isn't the law for him. I've had customers say, hey, didn't I see you on the, the internet? And were you stealing items? And then I have to explain to people what I'm doing. Astol even has receipts that show he was working in Walmart that day, and he's now trying to clear his name and get his life back to normal. Ideally trying to find a way to get him pulled down. He also says there was one item he did pay for that day. These flowers he was buying for his wife for Mother's Day, but the video ended before that purchase. Had they continued the video for another 30 seconds, they would have seen when I got done with the Spark delivery order, I scanned two dozen roses and used... Now, Astle reiterated, do not post videos on social media of strangers especially if you're not certain of what's going on. Reporting in the newsroom, John Kipper, First Alert 4. I guess we can't believe everything we see on the Internet. Imagine that. All right, John, thank you. St.